Hey folks, this is Game Master Mike, and we are going to discuss about the new Nintendo NX, which I'm excited to hear about. Now, um, here, what I got here is um, a Wii U and some great games, along with some a couple of um, badly made Wii U games, which I want to show you and show you some detail. And my opinion about the Wii U sales and features. Now, I really do like the Wii U. I love the design with the uh, gamepad controller with a screen in it. But um, some of the games I've noticed that this um, gamepad is like too long. Like if I'm like playing some games, like I have to like reach over to my other hand and um, I have to feature the difficult controllers. But with the screen in the middle, which makes it a lot helpful, I really do like the idea other people's don'ts. But that's their opinion. Now, um, with the Wii U, that um, it has the lowest sale of any Nintendo consoles besides the Virtual Boy. But um, to me, the Wii U is um, kind of an experiment that Nintendo is doing. Now, um, the NX, since the NX is coming out, it looks pretty awesome. And I've heard some of the launch titles were amazing. Like Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, which I am excited to see but let's hope it does pretty good let's hope the first day it sells tons of copies which I'm hoping and so we're going to discuss all these great games which I have in my Wii U collection and tell you my um, opinion because these are like one of the best games that's on the Wii U like Super Mario 3D World I really do like the uh, cat designs and the courses it's a sequel to Super Mario 3D Land on the 3DS. This game is pretty awesome. Now, Best Fighter is Super Smash Bros. for the Wii U. I really do like how Cloud is in this game along with Corrin and Bayonetta. And some other characters. It's a Ryu. But, um, game is pretty good. I really do like all the characters. It's too bad. It doesn't have a story mode or, um... They've um, taken out characters such as the Ice Climbers, Wolf O'Donnell, or, and Solid Snake. But oh, overall, it is a fantastic game. And we got Super Mario Maker. I really do love the um, Create Your Own Mario levels, which is pretty awesome. I really do like how you can create like Super Mario Brothers 3 and Super Mario World, which is a plus. And we got the Legend of Zelda remake. We got the Twilight Princess HD. I bought my uh, uh, Wind Waker Special Edition Wii U. It comes with win the Wind Waker HD and the uh, Zelda Hyrule History Book, which is pretty awesome. I really do enjoy it. And we got Bayonetta. This is Bayonetta 2. It comes with a bonus Bayonetta disc, which is a remastered port on the Xbox 360. I really do like this game on the Wii U, which is pretty amazing. And so those were the best games that I have in my Wii U collection. I really do enjoy this game. I do not own Splatoon yet. I've been meaning to get this game real soon, but I'm going to wait until the price is right before purchasing this game. And we got some bad Wii U games. I only have two in my collection. I got Mario Party 10. Game is not fun. I've um, played it a few times and it seems like it's boring and almost makes me um, be put to sleep in the middle of it. I don't like the uh, collecting those mini stars. I, I really do like the traditional classic Mario Party where you go around a board collecting stars. Well, they did it on Mario Party 9, but oh well. And uh, Star Fox Zero. I really do like the Star Fox franchises, however, this game to me, um, seems with the gamepad controls and the motion, it kind of, um, makes me a little, feel a little dizzy, I wish they could improve with the controllers a bit, but, um, managed to beat this game, but it's pretty tough. If you're looking for a challenge space shooter, I strongly suggest that you get this game, but, otherwise, um, if it kind of makes you feel dizzy, then, um, especially watching on the Wii U gamepad, then, um, um, I'll let you judge. 
And so, um, I am really excited for the NX. I hope it can also play movies. The Wii U was uh, intended to play some Blu-rays, but they had to cut it out because of price cuts, I guess. But, one of the top features on the NX is, I hope it's backwards compatible. I hope it plays movies. And I hope, um... It's 1080p HD where you can um, get a blasting view of some of the game features such as Breath of the Wild, which I am excited to see. And I hope the NX sells a lot better than the Wii U. I really do like the Wii U, but um, hopefully the NX will improve even more, which I am Extremely hoping and excited for. I hope they release a new Super Smash Brothers, a Mario Kart 9, a couple new Legend of Zelda games, Bayonetta 3, let's see what else, um, a sequel to Splatoon, um, another WarioWare game, hopefully some Street Fighter and um, other Capcom platformers like some Resident Evil games and list goes on, so many to um, mention, and there you go. Folks, that is my thoughts about the NX and um, some of the best and worst Wii U games that I have in my collection, and until folks, thanks for watching, and until next time, hope you like this video.